Hello guys, today I'm gonna show you how you can fix your blue screen on your Windows 10 or 11 if it pops up constantly and it's pretty annoying so let's get started to see how you can fix it so you go to start the first thing that you have to go, go to start and type in reset and click on the first one reset this PC system settings and then from here you go to advanced startup on restart now click on this one and now our pc will be restarted okay so here is the the window that we have to get to this is good here if you get to this but if you cannot get to this for example you cannot boot into windows you have to go to your pc button power button and hold it until it shuts shuts down and then after the windows logo pops up again you have to press the power button again and hold it to force restart it and then eventually you will get to this to this screen so hopefully you get to this screen and after this you go to troubleshoot and, and then click on advanced options and here on startup repair you first try this one if it works if this doesn't fix then go to command prompt click on this one okay so after your pc again restarts after you click the command prompt you go to here to your first account and here enter the password if you have any password i don't have so i go continue okay so this is where we where we want to be so now the first thing that you have to type is boot rec forward slash fix mbr so like this and and press enter now after this you have to type in make sure it says the operation completed successfully and then we have to type this one boot rec forward slash fix boot and click on enter if it says access access is denied no problem it's okay if it says like that it, it's not a big problem so it's okay if it says that now the next thing that you have to type in boost boot sec sec forward slash nt60 sys like this like this just like this so press enter and make sure it says everything boot compatible and boot code everything is successful on this one and now the next thing that you have to type is boot rec forward slash fix boot And press enter again okay the operation is successful so now go to next one next command is boot rec forward slash rebuild and now the next one is to go and sfc forward slash cannon now make sure make sure that you have spaces in between here
I might have mentioned that before, but make sure you have space on be, before this one, before forward slash. So I'll enter. Okay, we're gonna wait this one now to complete this verification. Now it's gonna verify uh, system files. So please be patient and wait this one. Okay, after the verification is 100% complete, you have to go to type another command, which is chkdsk c and two dots like this. I'm gonna type it right now. Just like this and press enter. As you can see, if you see this, like my Windows, for example, has no problem, found no problems. Now, if if you have any problems with your Windows system files, it will say that which files have been fixed and everything like that. So after that, after you've scanned, after your PC scanned and found the issues, now just to close the cmd and here go to continue exit and continue to windows 10 and now your pc should be restarting and here again maybe it will do some calculations verifications right here so please wait do not skip anything do not unplug your pc or something like that just let it do its work And as we can see, we're back to Windows. So pretty much this should be fix any blue screens that you have on your Windows 10. So that's it. Hopefully it helped you and see you in next video. Subscribe and like the video if it helped you. And see you. Bye.